Hey, what's good YouTube? It's your girl Kinky and you know I'm back with another video. So today's video is gonna be a trial haul, you know. And um by the title, you already know that it's gonna be from Pretty Little Thing, my new obsession. Like I'm literally obsessed. The top that I have on right now is a part of this haul, so y'all can see it now. Um I know you remember from the last haul, I think it was the last one, or maybe the one before that. Um, I think it was the last one though, because I think I only did one. But regardless, the last time I had uh top this print, but it was too big. I found this one, y'all, and it fits. And I got this in a size. Let me tell y'all the size, because y'all be asking me the size, and I won't be telling y'all the size. I screenshot everything. I got this in a size 10. So it's a US 10, which means it's a UK 14. When you go on the site and you're in the US, the sizes will be in the US sizes. The sizes, your size options will be US sizes. As long as the dollar amounts are US currency, then you know that the sizes are showing US sizes. Now, if you switch the amount to show um, UK currency, I think it's euros or something, then, um, it's gonna switch the sizes to UK sizes. It's like a different setting on the site. So long as you're seeing the US dollar sign, then the, the sizes that you see listed are US sizes. Another tip, because I have a lot of uh, friends been calling me, asking me, you know, how you know your size? Look at the model and um, compare her to your own body. If the model is wearing a 12, even if you think in your head, I do not wear no 12. If that model is bigger than you and she's wearing a 12, size down, cause it's accurate. Because I thought too, I'm like, no way, I can't wear no 12. And then I'll go up and it'll be way too big. So like, trust the models, it's real. So yeah, I got this in a size 10. Never thought I'd be able to fit a freaking size 10. But yeah, it's a size 10. And I paid $9 for this. So I'm not going to show y'all a try on portion for this. You can see it right here. But um, other than this top, I have a bunch of other things to show y'all. So let's just go ahead and get right into the video. Alright, um, the first piece I have, I just want to like correlate my uh, screenshots of what I bought with it so I can tell y'all the price. So I'm going to just go ahead and pick up the first thing that I have down here. Y'all, I freaking love this. This is a jumpsuit and I love it so much because it's super long. So if you're tall, it's perfect for you. If you're short, you might have to get this hemmed if you want it. But it's super long and like it doesn't really look like much, but it kind of is like um, Versace inspired almost like the print is this black and gold print and it has like um tigers and snakes on it i don't know and like it has like this little y'all know the, that's versace basically <laughs> but it's super freaking long it's a pants set and it ties in the front and i paid 48 dollars for this because it was already on sale and so i couldn't use my coupon code and i was like y'all i wanted this so bad i was like i'm gonna pay the 48 dollars why a couple days later it went on sale for twenty dollars i put it on my snapchat so if you're friends with me on snapchat k-i-e underscore d-a boss i'm gonna put it right here if you're friends with me on there then you would have saw it but yeah y'all see me trying it on right here and see how freaking good that looks i love it the only thing that i have an issue with is like this little gap that it gives me right here it's kind of big i could have went like one size down but it's okay because I love the way it fit on my legs. The top is kind of big, but you can tie it and adjust it. So I just tie it a little tighter. And I got this in a size 14. This is one of the examples I was telling y'all about. The model was wearing a 12, and the model looked about the same size as me. But I was like, mm, I don't see myself wearing a 12. So I got a 14, and I should have got the 12. Because I thought this wasn't stretchy. It's actually stretchy. It's But it's like a, a durable stretchy. It's not like a cheap stretchy love this so it's really worth it it's very thick and it's heavy good quality i didn't talk about that for four minutes that's how you know it's like my favorite piece all right the next thing i got this one actually shocked me so like i did a whole order um from the clearance section because pretty little thing doesn't mix their clearance with their regular clothes and so when i went in the clearance and i saw how much cute stuff that's how i found this top that actually fits me um when i went in the clearance and i found like all these cute stuff i'm like <clears throat> 
I'm about to just try to order. So you know with clearance, it's kind of difficult getting your size because a lot of times when things go on clearance, they um, don't have all the sizes. They only have like a couple things, pieces up and they're trying to get rid of it so they can add new things to their site. So this was one of those pieces. So I actually got it in a US 10. Now do I wear a US 10? No, not at all. But this dress is super stretchy and I paid $15 for it because it was on sale. It's this leopard print. And it has like the ruching, like two layers of ruching going down the front, one down the back, like in the middle, and then also on the sides. It's just ruching everywhere. So, you know, it's super stretchy. Look at the stretch on this. Like, look at it. And even though it looks super short, it's actually a good length. And it's like the kind of length I like my dresses because I hate those dresses where you got to keep. And it's not one of those ride, ride up dresses. So, I like this one a lot. And you just see me trying it on here. So yeah, and like I said, this was a size 10 and I paid $15 for it. Alright, the next piece is another dress. I find that on Pretty Little Thing, I'll end up ordering a bunch of dresses. I don't know if I think I'm a party girl or what, because I really don't even be going out. But I'm going out now as I got all these dresses. I got to go somewhere. I'm going to wear them in the house. Quarantine lifestyle might not make it. Alright, so I got this dress. And it's kind of a color I don't really have. And so when I saw it, I was like, mmm. I guess I'm going to get it. I think they had it in like black or something else. But I have so many black dresses. So I was like, let's get a different color. Um, and I like it because it has like this little cutout right here. And you can like wear this, like tie this up a lot. And so it shows like a little bit of that under boob. I think that's so sexy. Y'all going to see it right here. I got it in a size 14 and I paid $15 for it. This was also an item that was on sale. So I couldn't use a coupon code. But it also has the ruching on the side. And super stretchy. Super high quality. Really thick and double lined. So you don't have to worry about underwear showing through this. You might be able to see the lines just because of the type of material. But if you, do, if you decide to like wear thongs or like just free ball it's not gonna look like you're free balling because of the material is super thick and so it's gonna hide all those imperfections so i really like about material like this because girl your girl got imperfections for days all right the next piece i got i just had to have this this was probably one of the most expensive things i ordered but i could not pass on it i could not pass on it um the original price for it was 68 dollars 68 dollars and when you look at it it's really not even worth it like is the material is not that thick for it to be 68 dollars but it's so freaking cute that i had to have it i wish i would have sized down but i got a size 14 and the model was wearing a 12 once again key era hard hit itself anyways um but i ended up paying 27 for it and it's just this camel dress and it ties around the waist and on the model like the way it fits her because it fits right it kind of like poofs out a little bit it's so cute and i think this would be so cute like with some doc martens like i don't even have doc martens but like clearly i'm gonna have to get something for this outfit because like what other way could i wear it where the hell could you go like i need this i needed this in my life so i got it it's so freaking cute if i don't wear it with doc martens because i don't have any um, I will wear it with some black heels and yeah, it just says a UK large on the tag. So I guess it's just like a large. Let me find out. I can feel medium girl. You skinny. The skinniest legend. The skinniest legend. All right. The next thing I got is just this top. Um, I'm really into tops like this because like pretty little thing has a lot of super high waisted stuff. I usually don't wear crop tops this short, but because it, if I have bottoms that's super high waisted, I'll feel more comfortable. So like I don't have that big of a section out. Like this one is short, but I have super high waisted bottoms on. And so like, you see, so yeah, I'm going to try this top on with these same bottoms I have, which is just a black skirt that I got from Fashion Nova. But yeah, I got this top in a US size 10. Once again, a 10. But it was on clearance, so I had to like improvise and get the size that they had. And I paid, let me see how much I paid for this. I'm trying to tell y'all prices now. I'm trying to tell y'all prices. I paid $11 for this. And it's like a um a knit material. I didn't know it was going to be this material. 
but it's kind of like sweater knit material it's super freaking cute and it's super off the shoulder you don't have to worry you know how sometimes you have those off the shoulder tops that you like lift your arms up and they keep coming up and that's so annoying this one you won't have to worry about because of how much space so i love this so much and it's long sleeve and it just has these little like it kind of flares out on the end it's just so cute um yeah all right the next thing I got is another, I don't know what it is about the leopard in this haul or a cheetah or whatever print. Like, don't come for me, cat lovers. But I got this dress right here. This one was also on clearance. You can't really tell, like, what's going on right now. I think it was in the shape section and not the plus section. But uh, it has, like, this, like, bunching on it i forgot what this is called elastic on the arms and it's super cute it's like supposed to puff out and stuff only thing i really don't like about it is how short it is i'm probably gonna end up turning this into a shirt so if y'all see me with some bottles on mind your business <laughs> but um anyways the reason why i like this dress so much is because of the v like it's like one of those dv dresses and usually i don't like dvs because i don't like my boobs to be all i'm kind of self-conscious about them because like you know they don't sit as high as i would like but you know real bodies that's just what happens but this dress it doesn't look bad in it i actually really love it so that's why i could not send it back i paid 15 dollars for it and i got a size 12. if i would have got a size 14 i think i wouldn't have a problem with how short it is i think the fact that it keeps rising up is because of how much like how tight it is against me which is not super tight it's just the fact that if it was a little looser it wouldn't rise up every time i walk like that but yeah, y'all see me trying it on. I feel like I'm talking about these pieces a lot. I'm trying to zoom through it. <sighs> pay attention, pay attention. Stay with me, stay with me. The next piece I got is this dress. And it's this long sleeve dress. It's actually kind of warm for the weather that we have now. But it's short. So I think like the length of it from like not covering your legs will make up for the fact that it's long sleeve. I don't know. But this one is another one that has kind of like a deep V. And if you're looking at it right here, you might be saying like, here, you bought this to go to work. But y'all, on the body is, it's about to get you together, okay? I love this dress. I paid $14 for it. Um, it. This was not an item that was on clearance. So the regular price was $35, but I paid $14. I told y'all, go get that coupon code. Y'all ain't listening. Y'all don't listen to me. I'm trying to, I'm trying to help y'all but um i got this in a size 12. i actually listened to the whatever the model had on this time because the model looked a little bigger than me so i was like let me get a 12 the same size she wear and y'all it actually works um it's super stretchy well not super but it has like some stretch to it and it's not like a cheap material but um i'm gonna just let y'all look at the material it's not like a cotton either, but it feels kind of thick, you know? Um, it's not going to be see-through or anything. And yeah, I think I sold y'all a 12. $14. Get with it, I get lost. Alright, the next piece I got on, it's not a two-piece set, but I didn't really turn it into a set. So it's two items that I've been wearing non-stop. If you follow me on TikTok, if you follow me on Instagram, you saw me wearing it, you saw me posting pictures in it, you saw me making TikToks in it. Like, I freaking love this fit. And it wasn't even supposed to go together. Like, when I originally ordered this, it wasn't to go together. But, oh my God, it looks so cute together. So, again, I got one of those tops with, like, the off-the-shoulder thing like this it's kind of similar to the black one except the material is the same as that red dress i just showed y'all i hope my nails don't look that crusty coming up close to the camera like that and it ties in the front and i end up paying how much did i pay for this how much did i pay for this i paid ten dollars for this the original price was 25 but i got the discount and i paid ten dollars it's long sleeve and it ties around here these are fake ties though so it doesn't get tighter it's um it has the elastic on the arms and it has elastic around the top all around the top too i really love it focus on me all right yeah um i really love this top because like people was commenting it was like girl that top is good because i was dancing on tiktok and like you see how short it is and my boobs did not pop out because i love the way it fits it fits perfect i got it in a size 10 so i think for tops for me i'm gonna continue to go for a 10 
um, a 12 in t-shirts because I like my t-shirts to fit kind of like a little loose but as far as like tops like this that I want to fit fit it I'm gonna go for a 10 because it's seeming like that's my size repeatedly so yeah if you got a top portion like mine go for a size 10 in tops i'm trying to help y'all as much as i can now the bottoms that i was talking about i've been wearing with it y'all i freaking love these bottoms they have them in black and white i want to go get them my line sister jasmine already went and got them but they're like gucci inspired because y'all notice how the gucci uh, leggings be but it has the two g's instead of plt but you know <laughs> i can't buy no 300 dollar tights stockings at that so um i got these and like i love them because they're like ruched at the bottom they're like bunched what is this called elastic whatever it's, it's cinched in at the bottom it has the elastic on the waist it doesn't have a tie but you don't really need one the only thing that i can say about it is like the crouch area is a little baggy but i think it's supposed to be like that I got this in a size 12. I probably could have went down to a 10 and these are kind of stretchy. They have a little bit of stretching legs and stuff, but um, they do fit my thighs well. The only reason why I say I could have went down to a 10 is because of the crouch area, but they might not fit my thighs. So we probably gonna stick with 12s for the bottoms, stretchy bottoms. I don't know about jeans yet, y'all. I ain't never get no jeans from them. But when I do, you know I'm gonna let y'all know the tea. But I paid $16.80 for these. The original price was $42. The original price was $42 and I paid $16.80. Stop playing. What you waiting for? I'm getting fun about the day, baby. What you waiting for? <laughs> but anyways, yeah, so I really love these. They go all the way to the bottom. I wore it with some heels and a top on, I think, Easter. I'm going to put a picture of me wearing it right here. So cute. Love the way I styled it. $16 compared to 42 all right the last two pieces i got are bathing suits i saved these for last just because like i'm gonna make y'all wait because i know the dudes on here watching to see the bathing suit trial y'all gonna wait <laughs> let me stop all right so i got this bathing suit it's a pretty little thing bathing suit black and white with the uh like thick i guess i want to say victoria's secret inspired but everybody has this band now so i don't really know who is inspired by it but like it's like the pink it reminds me of my pink underwear the band but it just says pretty little thing and it has like this gap right here i think it's so freaking sexy the only thing i don't like about it is one of the, one side is bigger than the other or either one of my sides is bigger than the other because the band is a little loose on one side but i got the bottoms and these were the bottoms were ten dollars original price 25 but of course i got my discount so i got them for 10 and then i got the top the top is a little too loose i think around the this part from when I tried it on, I don't remember. And I got both the top and the bottom in a size 12, so I probably could have went down to a 10 just because of how loose it was, but it is stretchy and like the triangle parts are not that big. So if you have big boobs, this might not be the bathing suit for you unless you don't mind like having a pop out itch or whatever. But I love this because of how it goes around your neck. The only thing is, I'm probably going to have to get it taken in because of how big the band is. But love this bathing suit. Y'all going to see me trying it on right there. And the last item in this haul. Oh my God. Probably say the best for last. This item. Have I been telling y'all the prices? I hope so. This item, I ended up paying $16.84, which again, it was $42. Crazy. Only paid $16.84. Do not pay regular price. Please don't. I'm begging y'all. I'm begging y'all not to. Don't hurt my feelings like that. But again, it's another cheetah, leopard, or whatever kind of print. Some kind of cat print. And it's a bathing suit, like I told y'all. I can't really show you much of how it looks like until I put it on. But it's so freaking cute. It cross ties in the front. And like the string is super long. So like you can wrap it around you and kind of like tie it how you want. It is a thong. So like if you don't like your butt being out then you probably don't want to get this one but it is the beach or the pool like that is what it's for for you to come up there and just like flex on my ex in my mouth it's pretty little i don't even know what the rest of the song say but like come up there and flex so like why not i really love it at first i was self-conscious about wearing like bathing suits with the that going in your butt like that but i don't care no more i wear what i want because i'm popping so yeah got this one 
love it so much and like i said 1680 um all right guys that is all that i have for the haul today thank you guys so much for watching um as always like i say comment down below some sites you want me to try last time somebody told me to try asos so that's probably gonna be the next place i order from is asos i need some tops so this next order i'm gonna be focusing on ordering tops like um pretty like colorful tops because most of my tops are black and white um if you have another place that you think i should try comment it down below what else did i want to say make sure you like comment and subscribe Thank you guys so much for watching. We made it all to all the way to the end. We almost at 500. You know I'm doing a giveaway. So, you know, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. So you can be a part of that number when I do that giveaway. Okay? Because you know, it's going to be something good. I don't know what it is going to be yet, but it's going to be something good. But anyways, thank you so much for watching. I'll definitely see you in the next one.